Would you ride in a plane flown by a 12 year old? Well, your answer might be no, but what if we told you they were alongside some of the best pilots in the region? That's what happened today when the cadets of the Pitt Greenville Composite Squadron took flight. Now to your sides, Abigail Velez has more on the youth in the sky. So the pilot will go through the explanation of what he's doing the entire time. Once they get above about a thousand feet, they will now have the yoke in their hands. So they will be in the right seat. Each cadet will have an opportunity to make basic maneuvers by the instruction of the pilot. Captain Brian Hecker is the commander of the Pitt Greenville Composite Squadron. He tells me this is a big day for the region's youngest pilots. One of the very first things they have to do is pass several basic courses, and one of them is aircraft ground handling. So if they need to maneuver or move the aircraft on the ground, that they know the proper way to do it so we don't damage the aircraft. This aircraft is owned by the federal government. So. The squadron teaches discipline, focus, and dedication to those involved. Captain Hecker says this is a highly esteemed group to be in. We have three cadets that are going to be starting out this morning. They've been here less than six months. But we are encouraged by the National, Regional, and Wing Command to get these cadets in the air as soon as we can. Sean Stubbings is a cadet taking flight today, and it's his very first time in an aircraft. I'm not really that nervous because we got some of the best pilots, Navy pilots, flying us up there. So Matthew Blair is one of those pilots, and he says he has a heart for mentorship. Oh, I love it. I love inspiring this next generation of pilots, potentially and uh, just making good citizens out of people, getting them to understand aerospace and aviation. In Greenville, Abigail Velez 9, on your side.